What a perfect day for football we've got here. Martin Tyler here, along with Alan Smith on the television gantry. The game has all the elements, really, to excite us, and I'm sure it will live up to the billing. It is Empoli against Lazio. Yeah, thanks, Martin. Looking forward to this. We've got some really good players out there, and importantly, we've got some match winners, some goal scorers down on that pitch. And I don't think we'll be disappointed. And the first half is underway here. That's the kickoff. Empoli, here's their lineup for you. 4 3 3. And they've got natural wide players in that front three with a central striker. I think that's the key because those lads on the flanks, it's quite a complicated job actually because they've got to come inside, support the centre forward, and they've also got to funnel back when they haven't got the ball. So, has to be! Goalkeeper able to make a save here. The powerful presence of Chiro Immobile, the man to watch, we think, today. What do you think about him, Alan? Top scorer in the league, leading the pack with 27 goals. Lucas. Chiro Immobile. Into the attacking third. This could be it. Wow, that was close. It was a real drive, too. Flipped off the frame of the goal, I think. Well, he's well known for striking the ball cleanly. He certainly did there, from centimetres away from scoring. Luis Alberto. Giro Immobile. Correa. Could get the ball into the box now. Goes for goal! Luis Alberto! Now oh, he's off target. So easy in possession. Giro Immobile. Good vision here. Brilliant pass. Can he finish it? He's had a go here. And there it is! It's a good performance from a very good team. A team that we expected to be better than the opposition. That's the way it's panning out so far. Yeah, you'd expect them to ease away from the opposition in this match. I can't see any shocks in it, I can't really. No doubt about Lazio and their confidence and their class. They would expect to win this game. Henderson. Trying to pass their way into position to level the game. Well, he spotted the pass and cut it out. Giro Immobile. Well, he has cleared the danger. They're looking good when they attack. Here's Chiro Immobile. Should be a chance. That could be a game-winning moment to go two in front now. So a real captain's contribution here. With a fine goal. Was a good goal, and it came at a, a crucial time, I think, for his side. A real captain's input there. Restarting at 2-0. it out nicely I think we've seen it the visitors controlling possession no wonder they're winning sometimes you can have the ball and not be able to do anything with it but this side have been quite the opposite so creative and so clinical so far 
Read that well with the interception. That could open them up. Top performance from a top team, and they've emphasised their superiority with the number of goals that they've scored. Well, there is a big difference between these two teams, and that goal has meant it's reflected in the scoreline. I think uh, it's going to be a stroll from here on in because they've got a big cushion, rightly so, well in the lead. Now, well, the body language at this kickoff isn't great, is it? And you can understand why. That looked dangerous. Well, that can only be down to frustration, the way the game has gone to this point. But there's no excuse for it, really. Well, it's just typical of the way they've gone about the business. They... They haven't played well, they're getting soundly beaten, and now this, what a day for them. We are going to see a substitution now. Radu. And that's offside, the referee has stopped the play as soon as the flag went up. That's out, it'll be a throw. Cicciretti. Now he can cross it. Aiming at the near post here with a cross. Brilliant defending. It saved a certain goal. He was almost wheeling away to celebrate there. Swung in from the corner. It's a corner that's been wasted, really. Stopped at the near post. Oh, I love to see that. The referee playing the advantage. He's given the free kick. It's in a really threatening position, too. Well, I think he's going to go for goal. Why not? Great chance to uh, get his name on the score sheet. Couldn't quite keep the free kick down. Always difficult from that kind of distance to get it up and over the wall. Oh, just too high, and uh, it was coming down, too. It's so hard to keep these modern-day footballs down, but he very nearly managed it. Referee's had a good look and decided from what he's seen from this... Uh, Period of play to add on three minutes. That's Ari. And that's the referee signalling for half-time, blowing his whistle, and it's 3-0 here at half-time. Well, as you can see from the scoreline as we start the second half, there might not be too much of a contest left in this game. Lazzari, strong challenge. Lazzari, now Milinkovic Savic, Luis Alberto, Carre. Here's Chiro Immobile. Really at the extent of his reach to make that very fine stop. And here comes the corner. Oh, he could have made more of that. But it's only a goal kick. It's going to be a substitution here for the home side. Threads it through. Can he finish it now? He's just put it off target, just wide of that post. Well, his teammates were convinced he was going to score there, I think. Lucas. Joaquin Correa. Giro Immobile into the attacking third. Keeping the ball so important, they haven't done it. Well, we're two thirds of the way through the 90 minutes, half an hour to go. Played down the wing, 
Keeping the wide attack going. Looking to win it back. Gets his cross in. Looking for the shot here. Now that's a throw. Goes for goal. A oh, great work by the keeper. Still on the attack, and they've got a corner. Corner swung in, and the defender able to clear it away. Cleverly done. The assistant has raised the flag for offside. Luis Alberta. Lucas. Now Milinkovic Savic. Here's Chiro Immobile. Tries the shot here. Well, the keeper got to that and probably should have done. Yeah, you would expect him to save it, and he did. He's put in the corner. Got to get it over the first man defending, and they haven't done that from the corner. Lucas, Luis Alberta. Here's Chiro Immobile. Struck the post, could have come out, but in it went. Well, maybe a little bit of luck clipping the inside of the post, but he deserves that. Good shot. So off they go again, trying to make some sort of mark in a game that they're being dominated in. Nothing so far in this game to surprise us, perhaps only the, the margin that they lead by. Guiding it through, straightforward work for the goalkeeper. Slip through. He really gave it the laces there, didn't he, Alan? Yeah, he did connect with it beautifully. Not a bad effort at all. And on the clock, eight more minutes. Francesco Acerbi. Well, this is a real shock. You can see it in the faces of the players, and you can hear it in the lack of noise, if you like, from the supporters. Well, those fans can't even be bothered to give their players any stick at the moment. They're just... Stunned into silence. On the move and able to cut out the pass. <laughs> Referee's had a good look and decided from what he's seen from this uh, period of play to add on three minutes. This is a good opportunity to put the ball into the penalty area now. Takes the shot on. The ball's loose. Goalkeeper made the save, but he couldn't hold it. And he's blown his whistle for the last time. Well, I think when the decisions were made by the referee, we expected this outcome. We did, but we don't always get that outcome. But credit to the winning team. They played with their heads, with intelligence. They knocked the ball about and they made the opposing team really work.